Oh, we're recording. Hi. Hi, I'm Kay. I'm Kate. And this is Dr. Z. Hi, everyone. I'm here to talk about and show everyone my garden right here in New England, southern New England. So, Kay and Kate, where are we going to start here? Right here uh, at the pond? Sure, we'll start okay. at the pond. Yeah. So, we have so many, different, many different types of plants in the pond here. One of the things, this is a this is a papyrus plant, which I'll can take grow. I'll for it. That's, that's papyrus plant. Okay. And um, over here we have elephant ears. Elephant they ears. Look like elephant ears. Over here we have. Now this plant is deadly poison. If you ate this plant, you would die. Die? Oh my god. Oh my god. This plant is called aconite. It, or it's also called wolf's bane because it would keep it was used to kill wolves and wolf wolves <laughs> wolves Jacob <laughs> Where's okay. Jacob Black? Now we have Joe out. Pie we have we have Joe Pie weed over here. Joe Pie. Joe Pie weed named after the Native American Joe Pie who saved a whole colony of people from malaria and other mosquito borne diseases with this herb here. Um, we have a banana tree here. But bananas. These, but these aren't the really incredible banana trees that I want to show you. Okay. Um, I have banana trees that you can basically uh, not have to bring in, even though we have very cold winters here in the Northeast. So over here, we have some uh, palm trees. This is this palm tree is called the needle palm. And this palm tree actually can survive our very cold winter climates here in southern New England. Believe it or not, you can grow palm trees here in southern New England where it's really cold. And that's just incredible because when you think of a palm tree, Kate, I think of Florida. You think of Florida or Florida. Jamaica. But Jamaica. you can grow palm trees, you can grow palm trees here, and you don't have to bring them in. All you have to do is protect them. So Protect them. Protect over your palms. Here, we have more shots of the pond, of the pond. Gerald, maybe you can get the shots of the pond there. Gerald, <laughs> do your Cut camera stuff. Now here, this is one of the palm trees that we do not have to bring in. Gerald, can you get a, can you get a shot of that sign just, just there? Just zoom in on the sign. This is called Trachycarpus fortunae. Trachycarpus fortunae. Otherwise known as the Chusan palm. Now this palm also does not have to come in in the winter. All I do is wrap it with a little bit of insulation and it keeps it nice and cozy for the winter. So this one, if you can get a really good shot of this palm, Gerald, I'd appreciate it. Excellent. The Chusan palm, Trachycarpus fern. Uh, now come over here. Here's my little, my little gargoyle thing. I like He's it. He's kind of cool, isn't he? Can I name him too? Yeah, what's his name? Uh, Thomas. Thomas the gargoyle. And now wait, we have, brief, we have wait, different species of bamboo. Brief featurette of mittens. Just, just. 